from Dry Pink Stadium in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Good evening, everybody, and welcome to Lamar Hunt U.S. Open fourth round coverage here on ESPN Plus. Sean St. Jacques, Ross Devonport here with you. Excited to bring you this matchup between Inner Miami of Major League Soccer and USL League One's South Georgia Tormenta, the latter of who are looking to continue their Cinderella Cup story on here in the Sunshine State. Inner Miami hosting a US Open Cup fixture for the very first time in the club's history, and they'll be looking to deal with upstart Tormenta tonight. The hardest thing when you come to a game like this and just the emotions of it is doing everything absolutely normal. That is the most difficult thing, to just play normally, right? What does that look like? That looks like the attacking players. If you get through, you just slip somebody in, a wait a pass they can move on to. You get 1v1, you slot it in the corner. You get in a defensive situation, you don't jump in, you just back up, you make them have to do something special. That's what it takes. I've heard a lot of rhetoric this week from in here, but mostly outside. Oh, this is a game, Tremendous got nothing to lose. Maybe, but if that was a true feeling, I have butterflies in my stomach. So it can't be nothing to lose, because I feel that. And I think part of the reason I feel that is because this coaching staff has either recruited you or retained you because we see something special in every individual. That's why, because every man in this group, we talk about behind the office and like these boys. We want the world for you. We're desperate for all of you guys to be successful, okay? I'm nervous because I just want you to shine tonight. Go for it. Come on! We are underway. South Georgia Tormenta have already pulled off two cup sets over USL Championship opposition to get to this point. Inter Miami have already dealt with their in-state rivals from the USL Championship to reach the fourth round. And when push comes to shove, only one of these two will be moving on to the last 16 tonight. Zaya Sterling is also on now for South Georgia Tormenta. Arthur Bosway has made way. And we get the goal cast tomorrow. Should be a lot of fun. Sterling in behind here for Tormenta, and he scores. Kazea Sterling gets one back for South Georgia Tormenta. They've more than earned their goal tonight in Fort Lauderdale. Off the ball through here. Sterling one on one. The calendar got a foot on it, but just couldn't keep it out. In this round of 32 cup tie that sees Inter Miami of Major League Soccer advance to the round of 16 with a 3 1 victory over USL League One's South Georgia Tormenta. That was a bit of a scare for the first 30 minutes of this one for the boys from Major League Soccer. But Phil Neville's side were much the more clinical. Two goals from Ariel Lassiter and a goal from the substitute, Robbie Robinson. Both teams went down to 10 men, Robinson and Dangler, both getting sent off with straight red cards. But it's Inter Miami to win their first home US Open Cup match and advance to the round of 16. I think there's, there's ways to lose football games. And if you're gonna lose a football game, that's how this club wants to lose a game. There's tactics we could have brought in here and we sat deep, but we went at them cause them a lot of problems. Um, I think for spells of the game, I think perhaps we were maybe almost the better side. I don't want to be silly about it, but I really do think the boys performed that highly. And at the MLS level, with the speed that they have, they can be clinical and it's a lesson for our boys. We had really good chances and uh, we didn't take them. But at the same time, so unbelievably proud of the whole organization that we arrived here and how the players performed. If you're going to lose a football game, that's the way to lose it and uh, everybody's walking away with a hell to hell die. It was, it was good to get my first goal, I feel like. So a bit, bit of a bittersweet moment, but it was just good to get that first one. And from like, the team perspective, we came here and like, gave them a proper good game. But um, we had chances to win it, but unfortunately it wasn't our day today. But um, just, the team's, just the team spirit, even though like, we went down, down a couple of goals, like, we kept at it. And um, we done that, like, the travelling fans that um, came up here, I thought we done it proud. 